Today we will see how to reuse existing requirements from different projects. We will see how CodeBeamer has an automatic change alert when a change occurs in the original requirement. Reusing requirements with built-in traceability allows users to manage automatically variants of products across projects and department. And this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to my CodeBeamer. And as you can see here, I'm in my software requirements in the functional requirements. And here on the left side, I do have my functional requirements. But when I go to the right side to my requirements library, this gives me access to other projects such as the business analysis, the digital device, the GUI project or the hardware requirements. And I want to open up the hardware requirements, open up the requirements from the hardware requirements and let's just say I want to reuse the multi-finger gesture. So let's simply take this one and put it per drag and drop to our functional requirements. And as you can see here, with little c, this represents that this is a copied requirement. And when I go to its properties, I can see down there, this item is a copy of the original requirement. And when I open this one up in a new tab, as you can see, I'm currently in my software requirements. When I go to the original requirement, I'm in my hardware requirements. And let's see what happens when I actually change the original requirement. Therefore, I'm going to click on Edit. And I probably want to give it a nice little picture. Therefore, I'm going to click on Attach Files. I'm going to add the multi-finger gesture picture. And I'm going to click on Save. So right now, I just changed the original requirement. Then I'll go back to my software requirements. And let's have a look what happens when I refresh my page. You can see down there, the suspected link. This means the CodeBeamer has a built-in automatic change alert, which alerts me when the change happened in the original requirement. So when I click on the suspected link, it actually shows me th the changes that occurred. As you can see down here, in the original requirement from up there, I just added a picture. And when I click here on apply, I actually align the original requirement with the copied requirement. And then I'm going to click on save. The suspected link disappears. And I just aligned my original requirement to my copied requirement. And in such a way, to reuse the requirements with built-in traceability, it allows the users to automatically manage their variants of products across projects. Thanks for watching.